<laughs> After a long time, a few old friends gathered together. Kim was feeling a bit lonely after losing her husband in a recent accident. Kim, it's been a long time since I've seen you, and now that I have, you look so pretty. What are you talking about? She was always pretty. Kim lived in poverty all her life and was living quite well with the insurance money left by her late husband. Not long ago, she went to the Maldives alone on her dream vacation. The gentlemen have been fond of their mutual friend for a long time now. As soon as they heard she was newly single, they were quick to ask her out. Kim, I recently went to the police station because of a kid throwing away cigarette butts, and the world just looks different now. I can't waste my time hiding behind my feelings. We don't have much time left, so let's live together. What are you talking about? I asked her first. You can have your chance in the afterlife. What in tarnation? This bozo's wife is still alive and well. My wife died a few days ago. What? You're crazy. Kim is going out with me. With me. Kim gave a piece of paper to the old arguing men. What is this, Mrs. Kim? Proof of love. Proof of love? Yeah, it may sound a little weird, but I'm going to date the one who signs me up as their beneficiary. Put me in your life insurance. You think I don't know what you're up to? I know it's a ridiculous condition. However, I see it as proof that you love me that much. The grandfathers were in agony. However, soon after, both signed the life insurance papers. Now if the two die, Kim will be paid their life insurance. <laughs> soon after, the three went on a trip. The atmosphere was cordial, but the three had different intentions. Sooner or later, I'll invite this old man home, and using self-defense as an excuse. <laughs> if that happens, Mrs. Kim and I will live happily ever after with this life insurance money. Before you can even target me, I'll... Uh... <laughs> Mrs. Kim is mine. You're a bunch of naive old timers. I'm almost out of my husband's insurance from when he died a while ago. This is great. I'll spend your insurance money well. This is bear country. You'll both be bear food today. Goodbye. What was that? Hurry up and get in the camper. Kim, hurry up. Car key. The car key is on the table. I need it because the door is locked. Mrs. Kim, hurry up. Yeah, I'll find the keys fast. The bear's roaring was getting louder. They need to find her car keys quickly and get Kim somewhere safe. The door of the camping car closed. Goodbye, old man. I'll enjoy spending the insurance money. <laughs> And then, the rough shaking forest stopped, and so did the bears roaring. We're alive! I guess it just went by. Oh my, this wasn't supposed to happen. Instead of a bear in the woods, Oh, <laughs> <laughs>
Meat, 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 meat is delicious. The next day, in Chris's wake, there was no one. Nobody.